This is a Milbo S3 Chips Chips Chinese air pistol. Uh, I bought it recently, that was a used item. That was a piece of poo. Um, so I took it to bits, cleaned it up, made some bits for it, put it back together, shot it, and it was still the same. So all that feel a bit better. Um, what I've done, um, I made a new seal for the breech. Um, I'm going to do another video strip this down again because I must say that taking it apart was easy. That was not a, exactly a pleasure, but that was very easy to work on. Uh, on the piston, plunge piston on the back, there was a little groove. I don't think there was something missing, but I made a little washer to fit on that. I made a top hat for the spring on the bottom end, a washer on the top end so the spring can move freely. So it's all, it's all pretty tight and nice, but what I found was um, when I shoot a pellet out of it, if I don't push the pellet down a bit through the barrel, um, the foot pound is, is just ridiculous. Now this is only a one and a half foot pound gun anyway, so I'm just gonna check now. Yeah, so see what we get out of that. Yeah, so I'm looking at 0.56 foot pound, which is math. So I'll just do it now with pushing the pellet down a bit, and I think you'll see. I'll show the corner next time, guys. Just to show where seem really tight in the top and I tried firing it and I still feel tight now so I don't know whether that's the pellets or or I don't know so can you see that on camera does yeah, yeah. yeah half a foot pound velocity 171 so I say this is a this is a one and a half foot pound gun so what I'm gonna do as I originally bought this gun for playing darts um, Reason being, it's cheap as chips, and these darts tend to um, you take your rifle off your barrel. So, uh, what I'm going to do, I'm going to weigh this, um, and I'm going to see when I try this in the barrel, that's fairly loose. So, I'm going to say, is it is it projectile or is it the gun? Am I going to have to drill that top bit out? I don't know. So, we've got 12.8 grain. So, I'll just enter this into the grill. Now it's quite heavy for a 177 air pistol. Um, we've done a video reviewing these darts previously, so if you're interested in these darts, what say was that? It's 12 point what? Oh, I can't remember. 13.7, So I'll put the weight in the crony. Um, so we previously We've read these darts, so if you want to know more about the darts and what we've done and all the rest of it. So, right, so I'm going to use this dart. I'll just push that in with my finger, hopefully, them feathers won't get trapped. Okay, so, I'm going to push that in a little bit. Push that in a little bit just to make sure there's no feathers hanging out. And we'll try this through the chrome and see is it is it the projector on? Or is it something else? 0.19 yeah. yeah, that's just the weight of it is quite stuck all the way in, so that's 0.2 foot power, that's rubbish isn't it? Yeah. Let me try pushing it down a bit more. There's something something up like this. And everything the seal on it seemed good. Maybe that. No, that's easy enough through there. That'll just be the weight bringing that power down I reckon. I think maybe that's this seal in the, in the top there maybe. Maybe the first. I don't know. Um, I think what I'll do, I'll do another video stripping this down. We'll uh, maybe go over a bit more thoroughly. Um, I oiled the I oiled the washer on it. Maybe I should have put grease it instead, I don't know. Um, I'll double check that. Put it back together just to show you how it's stripped down so we'll be back with this um bit of a failure on this one again uh see you in the next one